Elon Musk says he wants the new Tesla Roadster to be able to hover, adding without, you know, killing people. Welcome back, dear friends. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. If you are here for the first time, please subscribe to our channel, join our community, and ring the bell so you don't miss my next Tesla story. As you know, yesterday Elon Musk had an interview with Joe Rogan, and I've reported a couple of important things that Elon Musk already said. But today's news is that um, uh, Elon Musk says he wants the new Tesla Roadster to be able to hover, and it's one of the big Tesla news today. It's in the media, everyone is writing about that Isabel Asher Hamilton from Business Insider has the details of that interviews that part about hovering um, uh, road Tesla Roadster saying Elon Musk claimed he wants to make the next Tesla Roadster able to hover off the ground basically flying i guess the tesla ceo appeared on the joe rogan experience podcast on thursday when the host asked about the next generation of the high-end tesla roadster electric car musk who has a history of making grand futuristic promises on tesla he does not always keep replied he does not always keep it was uh, business insider's word as uh, isabel writes replied saying I wanted to hover and I was trying to figure out how to make this thing hover without, you know, killing people. End of the quote. And here's another quote from Elon Musk regarding that saying, I thought maybe we could make it hover, but not too high. Maybe it can hover like a meter above the ground or something like that. If you plummet, it'll be out uh, the suspension, but you're not going to die, he said. Well, I think this is going to be very interesting. Um, I remember about 10 years ago when I was in one of the shows, automotive, uh, Los Angeles Auto Show, I want, I asked one of the automotive top executives, when do you think um, cars will fly? Uh, and uh, most of my coworkers laughed at me, but I was thinking that if things go this much, because we develop and we develop faster and we develop faster, faster, maybe within 10, 15 years, we will get there. And now 10 years later, Elon Musk is saying that he would like the, the actually the news is that Elon Musk wants the new Tesla Rots, Roadster to hover. Musk said the company was finishing the engineering on the roadster this year which will quote unquote hopefully start shipping in 2022 echoing a tweet he sent late last month so in 2022 if things go this way we may have hovering tesla roadster flying cars we're gonna um, we're going to throw some rocket technology in the car musk said uh, in the tweet if you remember now friends this isn't the first time musk has said that roadster will have rocket function in 2018, he tweeted there would be a version of the car with a SpaceX option package with 10 small rocket thrusters. Um, Business Insider's uh, report explains that Musk told Rogan the standard Roadster would have two small uh, back seats similar to a Porsche with a SpaceX option package would have a bunch of thrusters in place of two rear seats. Quote from Elon Musk, he said, at minimum, I'm confident we could do a thruster where the license plate flips down James Bond style with a rocket thruster behind it. And that gives you three times the thrust, Musk said, clarifying this would be on the ground. It is now that he is speaking about hovering Tesla. In 2016, Musk predicted Tesla would make a car able to do demonstration drive of full autonomy uh, all of the way to LA to New York by 2017. Tesla comes with a full self-driving mood but the company stipulates that this requires a fully attentive driver who has their hands uh, who has its his or her hands on the on the wheel and is prepared to take over at any moment you know musk has a history of pushing boundaries with tesla cars uh, though he seemed more willing lately to make choices that could force regulators to act um, uh, says the verge article on this uh, hovering tesla model uh, uh, tesla Roadster. Uh, the redesigned Model S sedan and Model X SUV announced last month, for instance, each featured a U shaped yoke steering uh, wheel that was reportedly a surprise to the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration. Those um, 
new vehicles will also automatically shift between park reverse neural and drive robin asked musk uh, whether the steering wheel was legal in the new interview where tesla, uh, musk also spoke about uh, the tesla roster that he wanted to hover so he robin asked about the legality of this new steering wheel yeah i mean they use a yoke in formula one musk said yeah, but you're not on the highway in a Formula One car, Rogan responded. I like driving like this, resting my hands on the top of the wheel. Um, well, autopilot is getting good enough that you won't need to drive most of the time, Musk said. I find you can rest your hand on your knee. It, um, it works great. In 2013, Musk bought James Bond submarine car from the spy who loved me and uh, pledged to make it uh, transform. He still owns the car but has not responded to repeated requests for comment about whether he achieved the goal. You know, if you remember back to the steering wheel about which Elon Musk spoke yesterday, um, on January 29th, uh, the Roadshow reported that NHTSA officials aren't sure if Elon's Knight Rider style will meet federal regulations. And uh, Sean Swakowski wrote on Roadshow that feds want to talk to Tesla about the Model S yoke steering wheel. It was not clear if they already have done it. I'm sure it's not difficult for them to talk to any automotive executive for NHTSA. So the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration told roadshow uh, on uh, january 29th uh, on that friday it has reached out to tesla following the news of its planned yoke style steering wheel for the refreshed model s electric sedan the government agency did not say if the automaker has been in touch with regulators since it debuted the radical new wheel uh, tesla on that week revealed the refreshed flagship sedan along with a revamped model x model x suv with the steering yoke grabbing eyeballs across the internet and on this channel we also have had a couple of reports on this and the torque news.com friends you can check it out roadshow's editor-in-chief tim stevens had laid out why the design is likely safety risk but u.s regulators will certainly get to the bottom of it and we'll probably soon will hear from an, an nhtsa and uh, elon musk didn't say in his uh, yesterday's interview with rogan uh, about this whether what kind of conversations they had with nhtsa at least i didn't uh, i probably missed that part if it was there nhtsa told roadshow that on first glance it cannot determine if the steering wheel meets federal motor vehicle safety standards if tesla in violation of the standards the yoke will have to go uh, they told Ro uh, roadshow but in the meantime the big news today is that tesla uh, ceo elon musk said he wanted the next roadster uh, road uh, tesla roadster to be able to hover and um, like a meter of the ground he told joe rogan he was trying to work out how to do this quote unquote without you know killing people and musk has already promised some version of the roadster uh, that will come with rocket thrusters maybe those rocket thrusters will be the ones that help the roadster to hover a meter above the ground well friends let me know um what do you think about this i just don't know if you, there's going to be enough enough uh, trust power and speed how can tesla hover uh, at low speed uh, by like less than 70 miles an hour but it may be possible engineers can probably do that this is armin harayan from torquenews.com please subscribe to our channel for daily tesla and electric vehicle news ring the bell so you don't miss my next coverage have a great day god bless you and peace be with all of you friends see you soon